Okay, I made a different valve. This one seals a lot better. It's not perfectly straight, the valve, when it's open, but it still won't really affect the, the flow at all. As long as it seals when it's closed, that's all I was really trying to get right now. I don't have very good tools here and everything to make it perfectly straight through. I was going to put it on the exhaust manifold, but when I build a long tube header for the truck, I have to make another one of these anyways. So as long as it's on the turbo turbine housing, then I don't have to make another one when I do that. This one's much smoother than the last one too. The other one I think I was having an issue because there's too much up here. It was too much pressure to try and go past that to open it. The wastegate I don't think was quite strong enough to open it up. So how I made it, I used a hardened bolt. Had a really smooth sleeve. No threads on it. Came about into here for this one. I weld that to there. Found a drill bit that was two thousandths of an inch bigger. I don't know what the chances are I had that, but I did. I drilled the hole through the housing and then through two nuts that I had that were for this bolt when it was threaded. So there's no free play in it at all. It's really tight, but it's still smooth. It didn't leak. You want to have it on before because I have this here as well. So anything that gets past the straight section in there, it's going to have to make a 90 degree turn. It didn't seem like it leaked at all that bad. The only thing I've seen any soot or anything around there. This one's much better though, much smoother. Much less impeding the port for higher flow. And it seals better, so it should actually spool it a little bit better too. Ideally, I don't want you to stain the steel for all this. I was actually thinking about, I could probably use an exhaust valve if I had the right size drill bit as a shaft. And I could weld to that. Maybe the next one. Here's a basic setup, made a bracket. Hold the wastegate. There's a brace underneath this steel plate there too. Underneath this steel plate. There's a brace underneath here. So it doesn't flex. I just use a 7.3 power stroke wastegate actuator that I had lying around. Seems to work. I get a video of this. This thing is insanely irresponsible. Yeah. 